Well, one, I want to say that Metro is an incredible team, obviously. They wouldn't be doing what they, what they do. And so I want to give my heart out to Tanya because she's a great coach and her team played extremely hard. But I am so proud of my team. They, they fought for 40 minutes, and I've, I've never been prouder for these six seniors, and I'm, I'm just very blessed and honored to be a part of this team. And I want to thank the good Lord above because it was an incredible time. I think one is team chemistry, and they want it. You know, you can go a long, long way with hard work and heart, and uh, that's, they, they've displayed that since day one. You know, we we started this season um, working extremely hard, setting goals for ourselves, and and uh, we've accomplished most of those goals, but we're still not finished yet. We're still not satisfied, and I think that says a lot about these kids. But one of the reasons why we keep doing what we're doing, uh, making history, and it's because they're just not satisfied, and and that's a good sign when you have a team that's not satisfied this time of the year. And so I'm going to say it again, very proud of them. I, I couldn't ask for a better team. Uh, they have my heart in so many ways. Uh, but uh, we're going to rest, we're going to get something to eat, and get after it again tomorrow. Nikki, Tuesday night wasn't the best, best night for you. You rebounded the night. You had 22 points, 7 for 14, about 50% from the field today, 5% from the three-point line. Talk about tonight. Just know I needed to step it up. I wasn't satisfied with my last game, but I was proud of my team for coming out and winning. And my players stepped up, and they did what they had to do to get that win. So that's all that matters is that we're here now, and I came and played. So couldn't have done it without the rest of my team, though, that's for sure. Coach, uh, rebounding was an issue for you in the first two matchups against Metro State. And although you probably didn't hold them to as many offensive rebounds as you would have liked, you only ended up minus three in rebounding. So how much of an emphasis did you put on that? A lot, obviously. Uh, we talked about, you know, we, we knew if we could limit their rebounding and second chance points and uh, defend the paint, we would win. And so I, I, there's moments that we had not too uh, sharp defense uh, transition or rotations, I should say, uh, but we did it when, we, when it counted. And so we, we really focused on that. And um, obviously it, it panned out for us. But I'm going to say this really quick before another question. I have two leaders beside me with Nikki and Brooke. They're our team captains and been a part of our program for four years and cannot say enough about these two young ladies as a person and as a, as a student athlete. And so i, I got to say to both of you, I'm very proud of you because this is uh, – you really have led this team and kept us together with team chemistry. And so I, I'm just happy for you. Thank you. You're welcome. Well, I think one time, and I've heard someone say this before, I said, play like you never want this night to end. You know, I said, every possession's got to count. And then right now, you know, sometimes that uh, heart and that, that want to, that persistence, uh, sometimes will outweigh the, mo the more talented. And so I think... Uh, one, I don't know if I've, I said that, but I think it's more of what these girls wanted to do and what they wanted to accomplish. I mean, there was great, we call them sticky notes, especially from these two, about what they needed to do uh, in those possessions when we got there. And so I think it was just a team effort. And i got to say that about my assistant coaches, too, and Coach Mahoney and, and uh, Coach Trammell. Uh, they did a uh, fantastic job. It was just a great team effort. Coach, you talk about these two seniors, but tonight, on the stat sheet, and it was all about little things she did, but if there's a third seat right there, I'd have to guess that that would be Krista Kona, who did a lot of the, the things that you don't see. She got offensive rebounds, she got second chance points, she was calm out there. Talk about her play tonight. Well, I, we always preach it's the little things that make the big things happen, and she's one of those blue-collar workers. And uh, she did come up with some big offensive boards when we needed it and controlled the team and got us set up in some of our offenses. But, again, I'm, I could sit there and talk about the entire bench because everyone is, was involved and focused, and uh, it, it, it was a group effort. So i got to say a great job to my bench and also the five ladies that were on the floor at the start.
she's special. Get another good senior leader. I don't think I have to say too much to Katie. Katie's already hard on herself. You know what I mean? And so I don't know. I can just look at her, and she just looks at me and just repeats what I'm thinking. And so she's just a, a, a good player, but she wants to do it for these seniors as well and for this team as a whole. And uh, what big rebounds she had there in the end. And also uh, she played controlled at the post, uh, going in and making some baskets for us. But the rebounding was, was the big key. She, I always say it again, she's a beast. And I'm glad that beast is on my team. Yeah. <laughs> Great. Brooke, uh, I remember talking to you when you were a freshman, uh, or your freshman year in the back when we did the showcase up in Madison. And, and at that time, you know, the program was, you know, kind of, uh, wasn't sure where it was going. And I think Coach Pound had just taken over. Uh, did you have any idea when you first started out that freshman year that it would grow into this, you know, monster where you got, you know, all these guys in red shirts and wigs and <laughs> body paint. And, and, I mean, it's got to make you feel good to be a part of that, you know, growing that program into the, to the point where it is now. It can't feel any better to come out our senior year and make it this far. I mean, that four years of hard work has really paid off right now, and it it's really exciting to be here with people like Nikki that have been here all four years with me. And we've just worked really hard to get here, and we just want to keep going as far as we can. Is there any thoughts about, I mean, you guys are in the championship. I imagine it was a goal at the beginning of the year, but, you know, NCAAs or, or, or you take, you know, what, what's the mindset right now? Well, we make team goals every year, and we just like to take one game at a time. I mean, we can't look too far ahead because we've got to win one at a time to get where we are now, and I think that's why we got this far to begin with, and we just got to keep taking it one game at a time. Aren't they great? Can I say that right now? <laughs> Aren't they wonderful? <laughs> Let me ask you about what are your thoughts on the crowd and, and how it, I kind of imagine it energized you guys tonight. To oh, yeah. Yeah, it's great to know that we have support, not just from our students, but also our community. <clears throat> a lot of them drove down, however long that takes, about three hours to get here, just to support us. It's awesome. It's awesome feeling to know that we are bringing people together that usually aren't together, like the community and students are cheering together for us. It's a great feeling. It's awesome. Yeah. Brooke, you uh, played basketball a long time. You've been through a lot of you know, surgeries and a lot of adversity. On Tuesday night, you ripped that knee brace off and got after it. Tonight, you hit the, you hit the deck, you got a jump ball that went Western's way, you got up here and said, talk about, just talk about how you feel right now and like, what, what this means for you. It means everything. I mean, I just go out there and give it everything I have. I don't worry about how much pain I'm in or that doesn't even cross my mind when I'm out there. It's, I'm going to go out there and give everything I have for my teammates that have always been there for me and just play with everything I got. Thank you guys very much.